so we found the Hobbit house. Oh. Do you know there is a Hobbit house right in Canada? Hello everyone, Wendy here. I keep a list of unique Airbnbs and this Hobbit house is one of them. When I knew I was going to drive through the province of British Columbia on my Trans-Canada road trip, I was like, I have to visit it. However, it's so popular, it's pretty much booked into the summer of next year. A little bummed, but I did not give up. A week before embarking my road trip, I saw a couple openings due to cancellations. I was so ecstatic. I secured one night right away. We are booked. This Airbnb is located on a secluded part of a mountain ranch, just outside a city called Osoyos in BC. The drive is adventurous enough with consecutive 180 degree turns. We kept on climbing mountains. We drove through forests. We kept on driving, but started to ponder where is it? Finally, we found the right entrance, the green gate. We were able to get in because the host left it unlocked for us. Once we got in, we found us in a giant ranch. So we found a hobbit house. This house is located in this giant ranch. To find it, it was actually a little nervous because there are just these uh, uh, ranch doors. You don't know whether it's right or not. Once you get in the ranch, drive is so long. So glad we found it. Yeah. This is like the third door we went through. Better close this to prevent bear from coming in. Pretty good. Atala! This is way too cool. <gasps> wow. This incredible house is built into the earth, much like the famous back end home in the movie and film series. Underneath the roof, you can see the large circular door and beside it are the two windows peeking through the earth. One is from the kitchen and the other from the dining room. A few feet away from the door is a fire pit completed with a couple of wooden chairs. At the price of $350 a night, it is not a cheap stay. However, considering the original filming location built for this movie is in New Zealand, this is cheaper than a flight ticket. Just saying. Hello, welcome to the Hobbit's house. As you open the door, you are greeted to a warm and inviting living room. Two leather armchairs seated across from one another, creating the perfect spot to read a fantasy book by the fire. Above the chairs is a small chandelier, and beyond that is a fireplace with a few lines of Elvis text above the mantel. To this side, this is the kitchen area. Uh, we have running water. I don't know whether back in you no know, works in time, if running water. It's feasible, but they do have it, so yes. To the left is a small kitchen that has everything you need to prepare simple meals, as it offers microwave, cups and plates, 
cutteries, coffee maker, kettle, utensils, and fridge. To the right is the dining room, features furniture and decorations inspired by the fantasy series. Alright. At the back of the house is the bedroom and the only bedroom with a dreamy canopy queen bed. Although the house looks tiny from outside, it makes you feel you have entered Middle Earth. But it features a spacious interior. Look at the high ceilings. Lastly, we have the bathroom. At the very end of the house is a four piece bathroom with rain shower and flush toilet. You would not have guessed this, would you? I hope you enjoyed my journey on finding the Hobbit house and the house tour. It is incredible how authentic this home is to the Hobbit house in the movie. I do hope one day you will have the opportunity to visit it yourself. And thanks so much for watching. I will see you next time.